Hey guys, what's up? This is LJS here and I am back today with an unboxing video. Today is going to be the new trial deck, the uh, VGE GTD 05 Faithful Star Messiah. So, um, this product was actually released uh, about 10 days ago, but um, I was at the Cardiff um, Team League for Bush Road Spring Fest 2015. If you guys haven't seen that video, my coverage on that um, Team League, go check it out. And I was there um, playing Vanguard, going for the Trios uh, tournament, and I didn't have, I didn't get managed to get my a hand on uh, one of these guys. So I got one, but apparently it didn't quite arrive in time. So I managed to collect it t today. So here I have it to open for you guys. So for this one, it's the trial deck for Link Joker, and um, as you can see, it features the new character, so the main character, which is Ibuki. And um, yeah, so you can see this nice uh, grey design. So now the Link Jokers are no longer evil. They're no longer like this black, awesome black and red rings. Now they are beings known as messiahs, which looks very fancy as well. So let's get to the unboxing, shall we? So as, you, as some of you may know, Link Joker is my main clan. I love it so much because, well, number one, the art is amazing. Number two, the names are amazing. And number three, I like the... Basically, I like control decks. So, Link Joker is sort of a control deck that revolves around controlling opponents and locking opponents. So yeah, so this is what we get inside. So let's open this as well. Yeah. So here we have the deck and the cover. So let's throw it to one side. And in this, we will have a little starter, starter's guide to playing Vanguard. So if you're a beginner, make sure you read this because it has everything you need to know to start a game of Vanguard. If you want to look at, if you want, if you want more comprehensive rules, you can go to uh, Vanguard's website and check out their um, more comprehensive rule book. But this is useful for beginners, so it teaches you the feel and stuff. So check this out. Then here we have a play mat given included as well, and this time it's a nice grey, white and grey design. Looks really nice. It looks really good. Oh, this is really nice, man. I, I love this grey scale look. And at the back, we have a little bit of introduction of the deck. So it teaches you some of the combos you can use with the deck, as well as some of the things you can use to boost your deck from the new set GBTO2, which is which is releasing, I think, uh, next week. So yeah, I'll be doing a uh, unboxing of that as well. So yeah. So now with all that out of the way, let's check out the deck. So for this deck, uh, this release, apparently one card out of one deck out of six would have what will have a hot stamped um, um, card. So uh, it's not the same as a signed one for the child, the child deck one, two, and three. So apparently it's not as nice because it looks meh. So let's see if we got it. So first one we have our main card, main grade three, Alter Ego Messiah. And we didn't get the hot stamp card. It's okay because it doesn't look that nice either. So yeah. So we have two. And the hollow is uh, like broken glass, I think. Yeah. There you go. Hollowed out. Bling bling. So that's Alter Ego Messiah. Two copies of that. So his skill is pretty good because uh, his generation break two skill is when something unlocks, soul blast one, and draw a card. So he's essentially, his uh, Generation Break 2 skill is sort of like the same as um, Chaos Breaker Dragon, which is this guy. Although his skill is that any card unlock, you can draw a card, whereas his skill is his skill is a bit more restricted. So yeah, and his other skill, the bottom one, is when you stride over him, kind of blast one, lock one of your rear guards, and you can lock one of your opponent's rear guards, and your Vanguard gains 5k. So basically, um, he is very useful because he, when you stride, he locks two cards. One of yours and one of your opponents, and a lot of, now Bang, now Link Joker focuses on locking and unlocking to you know do some combos. So yeah, he's a very good uh, combo in initiator with the new decks. So he's very important. Next we have this um, I'll strike Judgment Messiah. So basically, when he when his attack hits, you can lock one of your opponent's back row, and you may unlock one card, maybe your own card or your opponent's card. It's up to you to choose. And you can choose not to unlock anything as well. So that's the stride. Then we have four of these uh, crappy grade 3, 10k base, uh, counter blast 1, gains 3k when he attacks. No point running him. 
replace him with other cards that are more useful. Then we have uh, two of this guy, Wings of Phenomenon, Wing Matter. What a funny name. Uh, basically, his GB1 skill is when he attacks, he's a 16k attacker. And if you, when you ride him, Count plus one and lock one of your rear guards. If you do, you can lock one of your opponent's grade two or less rear guard. So he's he's sort of like a a backup lock initiator if you can't ride him, but he's way more superior. This guy's meh, they suck. <laughs> Next we have four, Awakening Messiah. Now this card is a really good card. So his skill is that when he is unlocked, you can choose one of your of your rear guards, restand it, and give it two k. So. He enable he allows you to do all kinds of restanding multi attack attack shenanigans. So he's a very important combo piece. So for future decks, you need to use him. Next we have two copies of this guy, one holo, one holo. So he's your um grade two generation break one boosted guy. So when he is boosted and he attacks the Vanguard, come plus one, you can choose one of your opponent's uh, grade two or less regards and lock it. So he also allows you to lock more things and I guess it helps combo with other stuff, I guess. And next you have this great 2 guy which is the 12, 12k vanguard attacker. So when he attacks the vanguard, generation break 1, he's a 12k attacker. Then you have two of these, uh, a special interceptor. So he's the special, special interceptor. When he intercepts, you can lock one of your rear guards that's not attacked. And he gains an extra 10k shield, so he's a 15k interceptor. Now he's, he can be useful if you want to build a defensive deck, but I would not recommend running him in a fully built competitive deck. Because there's a lot, there are way better grade 2 options available, so you can use those instead. Which will come out in GBT04. Yeah, Link Joker. I'm, I'm excited for this new Link Joker, Link Joker stuff. Next, we have uh, 4 Asleep Messiah, because he's sleeping, although his eyes are open, so I don't know why he's called, he's called sleeping. But yeah, he's your AK Vanilla for the deck. Um. Well, if you want to run him, you can run him, um, but I, I guess in the future, there's a lot of much better support. Next, we have this pretty useful card, Lockbreaker, Riddle, Bit, Riddle Biter. So his skill that is a generation break one, when he attacks, you can uh, unlock a card. If you do, he gains 4k, so he's 11k attacker if you unlock a card. So if you look at this, right, you can, there's already potential for two combos you can, achieve, you can do. A combo between these two cards. So, essentially, when you have this as your Vanguard, Strike him, lock him. When he attacks, you can unlock him. He restands. Now you have an additional attack you can use. There, you can achieve four attacks in the turn. So that's one. That's one of those many combos you can achieve uh, with the new Link Joker. And once you, once we have the new supports from the GBT04. Oh yeah, combos galore. Next, we have this. Uh, two of these copies of this. Uh, normal perfect guards. And she looks really nice. Although I was hoping, I, I saw this art leaked out before. I was hoping it was actually the G Perfect Guard, but it's not. So it's a trial deck, normal Perfect Guard. Well, normal Perfect Guards are, actually, are still quite useful because you can still you can guard your rear guards. So depending on what kind of deck you run, sometimes you might want to run a normal Perfect Guard instead. Next, we have this um, Grab Hand Gorilla. Okay, when this unit is attacked, he gains 5k. So he's an 11k defense and 6k attacker, which is meh, don't run him, he's, he's not really useful. Then we have the starter, which is Proto Sun. Huh, I, I thought it was called Proto Zoan, but it was Proto Sun Draco Kid. So basically when he boosts, if... Yeah, basically he's your, your 10k, oh no, he's a great one, my bad, not the starter, sorry. Three, you have three of him, so he's a 10k Vanguard booster. Generation break one. Then for a starter, we have Neon Messiah, basically the guy you see in a movie. I haven't watched it though, so yeah. Uh, his skill is that when he is unlocked, you can put him in the soul and search a deck for a grade 3 card with Messiah in his card name. So essentially, you'll be searching for him. So yeah, he unlocks, search for him. Then we have 4 criticals, 2 normal draws, uh, 4 stands, which is this guy. Four heals and two of the Margal clone draws. One hollow and one hollow. So lolly girl. <laughs> so yeah, it's pretty useful, I guess. He is she. I would suggest running her because she goes into into the soul and you can give three k to hit numbers. But she is also important to fill 
the sole cause of your harmonics messiah because his GBT two his GB two skill would be actually pretty good. I would imagine his second his GB two skill is very useful to gain advantage. So yeah, so that is the trial deck unboxing. Uh, my review of this deck. If you want to play the new um, if you want to play the new Link Jokers, I say get this deck. Get two of this deck because number one, you you would want four copies of him. You want four copies of him, and yeah, and you probably and you probably want to have four copies of her. So get the um, get two trial decks if you want to play this Link Joker. And if you are but if your budget is tight, one trial deck is fine because you have most of the components you need. So go for it. And yeah, so um, I'll get back to you guys with a deck profile on this when GPT-04 comes out, and we'll see what kind of awesome Link Joker shenanigans we can do. So. Thanks so much for watching. Uh, this has been LGS. Thumbs up if you liked the video. And I'll see you guys next time.